Hey there, Spark fans, Rob Reynolds here, and we are happy to bring you the new SparkFun LiPo Charger Plus. In this latest iteration in our single cell LiPo Charger line, we've changed a few things, added a couple of things. Well, let's just take a closer look. For starters, we've changed the input connector to USB-C. There are now three onboard LEDs, a power LED, a charge LED, and a done LED. With an input voltage between 3.75 and 6 volts, the MCP73833 chip can charge up to a maximum rate of 1000 milliamp hours and provides two forms of thermal protection. An internal sensor maintains maximum charging rate until the die temperature of the IC reaches about 95 degrees Celsius. The charge controller will then reduce the charge rate to prevent overheating. The MCP73833 also has an optional input pin for a negative temperature coefficient thermistor which we've broken out, thus gating the battery against possible damage. We've also broken out a pair of pins so you can swap out resistors if you need to charge single cell batteries with a capacity of less than one amp hour. And finally, we've added an exposed pad underneath the MCP73833 to allow you to add a heat sink if you feel your charger isn't charging at its fully programmed rate. Now, demonstrating a battery charger is probably the third least exciting thing you could possibly put on video. So instead of doing that, I'm going to play this little mindless LCD video game with one battery while the LiPo Charger Plus charges my other battery. A special shout out to Mohamed Magdi for this little tutorial over at the Arduino Project Hub. So there it is, the new SparkFun LiPo Charger Plus. Pick up yours over at sparkfun.com and happy hacking! Jump! You may have to do some rainbow unicorn graphics just to soup this up. I might need to do that for the audio. Yeah. <laughs>